Hello and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Today I actually have an Aldi grocery haul for you. All right guys, I'm gonna go ahead and share, share with you what I picked up from, from Aldi for the month of September. It has been a while since I've done one of these hauls simply because um, I have been picking up some things here and there from Aldi, but I haven't really been doing a huge grocery shop at Aldi. And life has just been so hectic that I haven't really um, had a lot of time to just kind of stop and do a grocery haul. But today I actually um, did have some time. Um, I just got back from um, the grocery store. It is the weekend. And we're actually getting ready to have some cheeseburgers and fries. So as soon as I get done recording this video, I'm going to make dinner. But I wanna go ahead and show you guys what I did pick up. I did stock up a little bit more this time because we did need some meat for sure. Um, there are a few more things that I am gonna pick up for the month. This is not gonna be it, but this is a really, really good start. So let me show you guys what I got so that this video is not super long. All right, so the first thing I picked up is this organic 100% grass-fed ground beef. Um, I do have a little bit left in my freezer, but guys, this is kind of the main thing that we, we've been eating lately. My husband and I and my children, we're all kind of eating uh, the same, although my husband and I are, are trying to eat a little bit more low carb, um, but this has kind of been the main meat that we've been eating because it is super healthy and it is only $3.99 a pound still. I don't know when this sale is gonna be over or if this is like a new price uh, for their ground beef, but this is way better than I can get even from Costco. So I definitely stocked up. I wanted to get a few more, but this was pretty much all they had. I will tell you, I did clear these off of the shelf, but the, um, there was a man who was restocking all of the meat, so I didn't feel too bad about grabbing those. All right, the next thing that I picked up are three bags of this Gulf shrimp. This is mainly for my husband and my son. They really like this, just sauteed in some butter and lemon juice, um, or I'm sorry, some lemon, lemon pepper seasoning, a little bit of lemon juice and some butter. But this is a product of the USA. It's wild caught. I'm, I'm not saying this is the best quality that there is, but this is a little bit safer option. So I did go ahead and grab uh, three of those. I picked up some chicken and I do have it on this bag because it kind of looks like it leaked a little bit. It definitely leaked a little bit in my bag. So I am gonna get this cleaned up and put in the freezer after I'm done doing this video. But I did get two packs of this chicken breast. This is actually cheaper than Costco as well. It's $4.99 a pound. I picked up some meat for sandwiches, uh, four packs of this smoked turkey breast. I picked up some Parmesan cheese. I need this for quite a few recipes, so I did get two blocks of that. I picked up some organic spring mix. We are going through uh, a lot of salad here lately, so I do not want to run out. I do have one in the refrigerator, uh, but we'll run through it pretty fast, and then we'll be ready to eat this one uh, and be done with this one before, I believe. Uh, the date on it is September the 7th. All right, I picked up some of these organic grapes. I like to have those um, just for a snack. I picked up some of this organic celery for soups and just some other recipes that I'm going to be making. I picked up some of these uh, organic cherub tomatoes. These look really, really good. They are so red and pretty. Um, I haven't tried these yet. I normally just get the grape tomatoes and I did get one of those as well, just so I can compare and see which one tastes uh, the best. But I did get one of those and I got one of these grape tomatoes. Those are gonna go for salads. I picked up two bags of these organic gala apples. You guys have seen these in my hauls before. Um, my husband takes these to work and we just like to have them to snack on. I picked up two of these containers of organic blackberries for my husband. Um, got two of those for him. Those were actually a pretty good price. I picked up a, a 12 of these organic pinto beans just for the pantry. And we will be using some of these this month as well. But um, I was really pretty low on the canned pinto beans. So I just decided to go ahead and grab some of those. 
I picked up this sourdough bread. The ingredients in this bread are pretty decent. They're not too bad at all. I'm gonna show you guys. If you guys have tried this, let me know what you think in the comments. But I was excited to see this. And so we're gonna have this for some sandwiches and maybe some grilled cheese. I picked up two of these containers of this non-GMO unsweetened applesauce, just uh, for snacking and just for the pantry. I got two jars of this organic uh, virgin coconut oil, unrefined coconut oil, because I use this for so many things and I don't have any more, uh, any more stock in my pantry. So I got two of those. I picked up some organic mini cucumbers. Those are gonna be for salads. These were the only organic cucumbers that Aldi had, so I decided to go ahead and grab those. I picked up four jars of these, um, what are these called, guys? These mild pickled banana peppers. These are so good. We put these on absolutely everything, just about. We put them on sandwiches and salads. I like to just snack on them. They are just that good. So I did get four jars because we will go through these very quickly. All right, I picked up one container of the beef bone broth. For some reason, every time I go to Aldi, I can only find one. <laughs> so I decided to go ahead and pick that up because I actually do need some bone broth in my pantry. I picked up two bags of these organic yellow corn tortilla chips. Uh, because we need some tortilla chips for salsa, for snacking, and probably for a couple of uh, Mexican nights that we're going to be having. And I picked up this thin sliced, these are actually new, I don't think I've ever tried these before, but I did buy, um, as you guys will have seen by the time I upload uh, this video in my, I think you guys saw that in my Azure haul, that I picked up some of the Dave's Killer uh, bread it was the sprouted seed bread and my daughter really really liked that and I saw this it looked very similar to that bread but for a fraction of the cost and the ingredients are actually pretty similar pretty clean there they are right there so I decided to go ahead and get this for her to see if she uh, would like that it's really soft bread I'm gonna actually keep this in the refrigerator I think though uh, just so that it doesn't go bad on us because it does have September the 10th on it Also, the very last thing that I picked up is this this is I guess another Version of this is supposed to be similar to another version of the Dave's killer bread. This is the What is it? Knock it's the knock your sprouts off sprouted seven grain bread, so I think this is there's a, a sprouted seven grain bread that um, Dave's Killer Bread makes. This is supposed to be similar to that, I think. And I don't think this one is, well, yeah, this one's thin sliced too. And it looks really, really good as you guys can see. I'll show you the ingredients on this one as well. But yeah, I'm pretty excited for my daughter to try this. And I'll probably have some as well with peanut butter and banana. That's kind of how we like to eat our toast. But yeah, that is everything that I picked up from Aldi for the month of September so far. Um, if I do pick up some more items, if it's enough, I'll probably do another haul and show you guys. But um, right now, just offhand, I can only think of a few things that I really need to go back and get. Um, if I do um, a Costco haul, which I don't think I'm gonna get much at Costco because I have really kind of been trying to be a little bit more strategic in how I'm shopping at Costco. And I really, really like the things that I found at Aldi today. So I'm probably gonna start doing a little bit more shopping at Aldi just to save a little bit more money and only get those specific things that we can only get from Costco at Costco. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please put them in the box below and I will talk to you guys in my next video.